Welcome to day 912. We are en route to being en route right here. To California. To San Diego, California. Friggin' rights. Ken and I are flying together through San Francisco, so we get to fly up into the Bay Area. We're picking up Kenan now, and there's his mom and sister, so we'll say hi to them and then go west, actually northwest to Cleveland Hopkins. Boom! Welcome, Kenan. We picked him up! We're all here. We just picked up our prostitute back there. Oh, uh, Hudson Plumbing is heading Hudson to your house. Hudson Plumbing. It's no bueno. Uh, my mistake. Uh, shit, literally. We're en route to Cleveland Hopkins. It's 142. We should be there. We gotta park the car. Probably about 2, 230, 240. We'll keep you up today. I don't think the flip picks her up, but there's Cleveland hiding in the gray. That doesn't even look like Cleveland skyline. The top of Terminal or the top of Key Tower is white, so it looks like a square building. Anyways, we're on 480 West. That would be 77 up into the city. It's crap weather, 76 degrees, and look at that. Holy crap. This is the best part. Oh yeah, buddy. This is the best part. Hopkins. Am I on Cold Select 2? We're using these just to burn energy because they're better than escalators, so get to climb now. Because I almost just tripped. Boom. Oh you took the escalator, you fool. It's supposed to be an A320. I can't even tell. It could be a 737 from here. Check in, all calls. Ready to go. It's supposed to take off in five minutes. This will be your indication that it is then safe for you to move about the cabin. Please keep your seatbelt fastened at all times while seated. Car. I don't see Canada. Please refer to the insert too the far and too cloudy. for more information. This aircraft is equipped with three laboratories. That's there 480 right there. Towards the rear of the right aircraft. over towards North Olmstead. You are seated in the economy section. We are I don't see downtown because we're headed southwest. Uh, 293 miles an hour. Come to the cabin, knock me up, beverage of your choice. 
a selection of everything that we have to offer is in your complimentary copy of the Hemisphere's catalog. That's Sandusky to our north, so is that Cedar Point? That thing that sticks out or over there somewhere? I don't know, it's been a long time since I've come up here. One of those things is Cedar Point. Alright, that's Port Clinton and Putten Bay, which puts Cedar Point over there somewhere. Yay! Seven thousand four hundred seventy-eight feet in elevation, five hundred thirty-seven miles per hour, and our location is just south of uh, Chicago, leaving Indiana, entering the state of Illinois. Thirty-seven thousand feet. Illinois into the state of Iowa. Welcome. Welcome to Nebraska. The sun is actually shining now. Down below us directly is DEM, Denver International Airport. I can't believe we we're actually flying right over it, 39,000 feet. Directly below us. Welcome to Colorado. Over the Rockies. You can see some snow out there. Western Colorado. Oh, I like that kind. Hello to the Rocky Mountains, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I wish you could see out this window better, but that's Route 70. That's what we drove a year ago in a week. See it? Route 70, west of Denver. Ah, the state of Utah. Welcome to Utah, it looks nice. It's right up Lake in southwestern Utah. Um, probably a couple hours south of Salt Lake City on the 15, which is back there. Departing Utah into the state of Nevada. Yosemite, welcome to California. Modesto, California. Oh, I see the San Francisco Bay. Yeah. Coming in uh, a little early, I think. Eastern or Western Pacific time, 7.34. I think it was supposed to be an 8.12 landing, so this is nice. We're down probably at, uh, I don't know, 8, 10,000 feet. I'll film more. I see the Trans-American Pyramid out there and the end of Route 80. Oakland Bay Bridge. The flip probably doesn't pick it up, but it's out there. We're going to try that again. you see anything out there? I can't see on the screen, but it's dirty. It's a little, a little thicker. But it's there. Yeah, you can see it. The exact same pipeline I use it. I can still use it. I have done this landing and this final so many times on X-Plane. It's weird to do it in person. And touchdown. Welcome to San Francisco. Tony Bennett had a song called San Francisco. Oh, Kenneth knows what I'm talking about. Friggin' right. All right, we got an hour and a half to catch our flight to San Dingo. I think we can do that. Blue skies, somewhat. Welcome to San Francisco. He got it right. He's been saying Chicago the entire flight, and we ain't going to Chicago. We will be taxiing for a few more minutes, so please remain seated with your seatbelt. Oh, yeah, I love these things. It's like you're walking 40 miles an hour. Look at that. I like this guy. Then you get off and you about dive into the carpet because you're going too fast. Anyways. Welcome to San Francisco, California. My first time here in about 13 years. Um, it's cloudy and 65 outside, but it's anything that's nicer than Cleveland. Happy to be here. We've got about an hour to make our connecting flight, and I believe gate 86, which is on the same terminal and concourse. So uh, hopefully we'll be set. Oh, look. 
another view out the window of an aircraft. This time, a Boeing 737 8 or 900. This is the 800 series. Um, KSFO Terminal 3, Gate 85, headed to San Diego, leaving in approximately 30 minutes, arriving in approximately two hours for uh, a couple days, and it's going to be good times. I see Kenan coming. He got hung up for some reason. He's on his way. All right, they switched me. New view. 37,000. We'll go down to the gate. One of the first officers will perform a walk around. It's a visual check of the exterior of the airplane. There's a series of cockpit checks that we go through. The flight plan, the instrumentation. trees, 65 degrees, not a cloud in the sky. Welcome to, is this Terminal Access Drive, Harbor Avenues out there. We in San Diego, boys, it's beautiful. And there be DM5. All right, let's load up. We are here, we have made it, all of our stuff's here. Got back to the apartment, we took a little tour around the uh, complex here, show Colt since he's new. So, uh, Friggin' rights. That was a busy day of traveling. We covered about, through San Francisco, probably probably nearly 3,000 miles. Really good flights, though. Everything was on time. They're starting the editing process of stuff. And I'm sure my vlog is very long, so I'm going to jump on that. Tomorrow will be a better day. You'll see more of this place again in, in daylight, and hopefully we'll see some of that city. All right, guys, thanks for watching today. I'll talk to you tomorrow on 9.13, I want to say. Good night.